my channel, Andrew Makes. Before we get started today, I want to let you know that something has come up in my family and I need to be out of town a couple days to help. So I hope to be back and have a Vlogmas on Friday. Okay, today is Monday, December 13th. It's about 7.05 a.m. and it's about 32 degrees Fahrenheit. And for dinner tonight, I'm using the Southern Keto Beyond the Basics Cookbook by Natasha Newton. And we are having Shrimp Alfredo Spaghetti Squash. And this is really fun to make because you bake the spaghetti squash and then you shred it and you leave it in the shells. And then you make the shrimp alfredo and put it in the shells on top of the shredded spaghetti squash and then bake it and just eat it out of the shell. So it's really good and yummy. And let's move the star on the pillow. I did move the star over the weekend, but I didn't open the advent calendar because I want to do that with you guys. Okay, we have three days to open on the advent calendar, and I want to let you guys know I'm about keeping it real here on my channel, but when I was prepping for today, I was going ahead and opening the doors that I've already opened so I can find the ones that I haven't opened quicker. And I noticed that on the back of the doors, it says what's in the advent calendar for that day and I have been scanning the back all this time trying to when I didn't know what was in the calendar but I thought that was so funny that it is written on the the flap here and it only took me 13 days to figure that out but anywho let's do the 11th which was Saturday it's right here it is thread polyester thread in white. A nice large spool. Very nice. Okay, let's do the 12th, which was yesterday, Sunday. It is right here. Let's see what's in there. It is. Let's read on the flap. A travel kit with threaded needles. That's neat. They're already threaded for you. And all the basic colors you would need. And then today's, the 13th, is right here. Let's see what's in there. It is a seam ripper in my favorite color, pink. So that's fun. And today's question is, which of these patterns would you like me to make? Because this is Viewer's Choice Vlogmas Edition. If you're not familiar with my Viewer's Choice, every month when I do my plans video on my channel, I let you decide by voting what you'd like to see, one thing that you'd like to see me make that month. And it can either be, I give you different patterns to choose from, and vote for, or a different fabric, you get to pick the fabric, or a different view, which view on the pattern you'd like me to make. And it has been so much fun, I love it. And thanks to everyone who participates every month. So this month for Vlogmas, I want you to help me decide which top I'm going to make to go with these pants. I made these pants a couple weeks ago. Let me show you the pattern. This is Butterick 6865. I can't stop making these. This is my third pair that I've made. And I make View B. And I have a pattern review on my channel for this pattern if you'd like to check it out. But I love this pattern and these pants so much. But I make mine without the drawstring. And here they are. This is a 
Cotton Blend Luxe Velour in this gorgeous burgundy color and I got it from L.A. Finch Fabric and she was having an end of the bolt sale and I got four yards of this for $25. You cannot beat that but I love the color. It's this deep rich burgundy and here are the pockets and there's two rows of half inch wide elastic sure if you can see that but anyway I love these pants but I want a top to go with them that I could wear together as a set and then I can wear them separately of course and here are the patterns that I want you to vote for and instead of voting for the actual pattern numbers we're gonna have different words that we use to vote for because that's easier for me when I go to count because I don't have to keep referencing the pattern number and all that but anyway there's four choices and choice number one is, I'm going to go over these once and then I'll go over them again at the end so you can remember. But please be sure and vote. I can't wait to see what you pick. And please vote by midnight Thursday, December 16th because I can't wait to see what you pick and I want to get these made so I can wear them. And I'll be announcing the winner on my last Vlogmas which will be December 23rd. Anyway, back to the choices. We're going to call this, when we vote, Vintage. This is Simplicity 7798 from 1997. And View C. This cropped turtleneck. This is the Vintage option. And here are the line drawings. Right there you see for the that's the vintage pattern and the next choice is simplicity 9014 and we're going to call this the slouch neck and the option is view D it's a cropped slouchy neck top but I want to make it long sleeves so I will use the the long sleeves from the other views but slouchy neck is the next choice and then here are the line drawings for it so that's slouchy neck and then the next option we're going to call this toaster sweater because this is the toaster sweater it's simplicity 8529 but this is by so house 7 and view here's the pattern and then view D, that's an option. And it has this really cool funnel neck. And here, here's the line drawings for it. It's view B. I can't remember if I said D or B, but that's the toaster sweater. That's how we'll be voting, view B. And then the last option is something totally different. It's McCall's 7331. This is from 2016, I believe. And it's View A, which they don't have a picture of View A by itself that you can see. They have it covered up with a jacket, but it's basically this, but it's long sleeves. And this is a Nancy Zeman pattern. So let's go over the patterns again for you guys to vote. If you want the vintage pattern, write vintage in the comments. And if you want the slouchy neck pattern, write slouchy neck in the comments. But that will be long sleeved. And if you want the toaster sweater, write toaster sweater in the comments and if you want the long sleeved t-shirt write long sleeved t-shirt in the comments i cannot wait to see what you guys pick thanks for watching and i hope to see you friday bye